This video builds off of my two previous videos on making and using a water level and checking your laser level. You might want to review those before proceeding with this video. After you complete the water level setup, you'll need a good standard level. I'm using a two foot level, but the longer the level, the better. Shim the level is required to get it exactly level. This is the laser pointer I'm using. It came from an old Dell projector that's already been discarded. I installed a very small fine thread dual nut and bolt in the battery cover. This gives me a solid triangle for adjustments. It sits right on top of the level. Note that the level is at one end of the water level. By shooting the near end I get a starting point for reference adjustments. Now I'll shoot the opposite end of the water level. This can be difficult during the day to see the laser. You'll see a little later I've addressed this problem. Here is how I adjust my laser pointer. The two nuts work as a dual jam nut against the cover. Here's what the other end looks like. Note that I've shimmed and filled both ends of the water level exactly full. It makes taking reference measurements a whole lot easier. Here's my solution to seeing the laser in the sunlight. This definitely requires a calm day, but only need about an hour or so to set the laser pointer up. Hope you found this useful. Take care. Have a great day.